Good morning. Today is the 24th of February, 2023. I think you're hearing it. Um, I had um, a really rough day yesterday. And I've been telling you or promising or threatening to tell you guys that, that there will be a condition update and today obviously is the day for that considering what you're seeing on the screen at least what i'm presenting on the screen today i <clears throat> excuse me the way i feel and sound it's pretty obvious that it was a really rough day yesterday we had one of your typical uh canadian storms here the last couple of days or i guess two days ago carried on into yesterday. Uh, me having an agenda, like I had a very early, um, for me, eight, like I consider like an eight o'clock, 8.30 um, appointment for health appointment pretty early. But it is what it is. And I stepped out into the brave, um, <laughs> brave, into the horror that was this, this storm. Just a quick background. Uh, if you live in Canada you know, or in Ontario, you know what you're what I'm talking about. We had a bit of a, I, I'm guessing maybe half a foot to a foot, depending, of uh, snow uh, fall, but it was layered with two ice events. So you can imagine, there there was the first ice event of snow, and then ice event, and then more snow, and another ice event. Fine. Well, at eight in the morning, you know, um, <laughs> not all the clouds are out yet, and not everyone has done their sidewalks yet, right? So there I am with my walker, trying to get through this, and you can't get through it without lifting it. Like usually, it's got wheels, of course. Usually, usually I can just uh, roll my way through my um, agenda. Not so much yesterday. I yeah, got a lot, but it was bad. Uh, not only were some of the streets not done, so I barely used the bike lanes as I like to do <laughs> in, in, in events like yesterday, but um, the, the, the the bike lanes were also, there was so much snow, like, ugh, it was drama. I had to like, constantly be picking up my uh, thing, my uh, walker, just to get through <laughs> to, to from point A to point B. Turns out that uh, I was, at least my train stop from here is maybe like a 10 minute walk. At this point yesterday, it was at least a 25 minute walk. I mean, it was that bad. Well, I get to the train uh, station and the, the uh, weather has delayed the train so badly that they were encouraging me to take a bus. Uh, they, I personally, my two cents is they have a really bad communication skills because they'll, they'll tell you take the bus, but they won't say we're only delayed for an hour. We're only delayed for a bit. They'll say we're, we're services are cut. Good luck to you. There's a bus. So okay. So there's no bus, but oh, no, I was decided to get to a bus, right? <laughs> which is a little further from my destination. So I can get there, like I said, hobbling along, wanting to find out that the bus, the closest to me, no longer takes me to where I needed to go. Really? Oh, okay. So pushing on through, because that's just me being me, um, pushed on through. And then as I'm pushing on through, there goes the train. <laughs> it's like, oh, really? So uh, it was only a hiccup it was only a delay until you cleaned off the ice i'm assuming uh, so i made it to it what usually is a 10 minute uh stroll with my cane took me over an hour to get to two stations from where i usually grab my anyways i made it thank god i mean i do have the stamina to do it but boy am i paying for it now and am i ever in rough shape one thing which, uh, and I did talk to my doctor about this, as, I, as I'm doing my um, getting on through in the, uh, in, in the remnants of the storm, oh, it was tough, um, I'm grunting a lot, <clears throat> you know, 
it's like, why do I do that? Says I to the doctor. It's like, I try to keep it as under control as I can, but you can't. He goes, have you ever seen people working out? Yes, I used to work out, right? That's where the grunting comes in. The grunting allows for more um, air to be expelled because the expulsion of air is what gives you the strength to do, because then you take the, the breath in, gives you the strength to uh, carry on or to push yourself through from regular breathing. Um, it, it heightens it a bit. So says my doctor. So for all those that say, you know, it, it bugs me when you do it. You know, it bugs me when I do it too, but I don't do it on purpose. And there is a physical <laughs> uh, reason for it. Just thought I would share because I surprised myself at how much grunting I was doing yesterday. That said, I got through the uh, uh, checkup and all of that kind of stuff. So I'm doing okay, but I'm not doing the best, but I can still do it. And I think that's the point I'm trying to make today. I've been pushing myself a lot over the past uh, week. I have to. Uh, uh, not only just the uh, daily existence, but I also have, like, uh, you guys are aware that I'm doing a housing transition, and that, unfortunately, involves a lot of meetings and a lot of uh, work. I mean, a spade a spade, that's what it's doing. I'm up for it. Boy, I'm not sometimes up for it when I go through what I just went through yesterday. Yikes. Today I had to postpone a um, a meeting just because I can't do it. Like, uh, yesterday really took it out of me. What is normally a hour and a half with transportation took me <laughs> like four hours. It was, it was rough, maybe three, okay, there, that, that touch exaggeration, but you know what I mean, it certainly felt like four, and it was, it wasn't easy, but it was doable, and that is a point I guess I'm trying to make today, like, uh, I do have enough stamina strength in me to push on through, which I did, and uh, as rough as it was, yesterday was probably one of the rougher days I've had in a while, oh, <laughs> And just, of course, for, uh, just to make it the icing on the, the, the top of my Sunday of yesterday, excuse me. Of course, I've got my, my walkway to do, right? Like, uh, if postman uses my walkway, we're to slip and fall in all the snow. Guess who's getting through, right? <laughs> At least that's what my understanding. That, and I also have pride of place and all that kind of stuff. So anyways, I came home exhausted did a little bit of recovery yes a couple of cups of coffee will help <laughs> and was right out there shoveling and it was one of the rougher shovels I've ever done which is interesting because of like the, the 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 ice layers you chuck into the snow and you're pulling off a huge slab and now you gotta find the strength to sort of pitch it over I'm explaining to you how you shovel snow but Trust me, maybe for posterity, I need to, I need to get it off my chest because it was a lot of work. But I did it, like I said, and that is my, you still got it in you, kid. <laughs> kid, the old, the old man, you still have what it takes to at least get through some rough patches. Anyways, I just wanted to give you a bit of a health update, uh, and I did because that's what's going on behind the patch this morning. I will talk to you guys later. Hope you guys have a good rest of the day.